Okay. So today we're gonna do a bird with colored pencil. So this is the, the pa uh, pad that I have, or the paper that you have, right? So I'm just tear it one piece out and about quarter down to the page. I'm gonna start do the head like this around it. Top. Why is it's okay here? And then we're gonna have a, a the peak. The peak here. You see that? It cross over that side and then come this way. Right? And then on the bottom part of the peak, like this. Like a little docky peak, right? <laughs> no, but it's not, it's a bird. After we do that, just do some outline of the bird and then we're gonna color pencil it. So have a fat tummy coming down, right? Good job, Tristan. And then we're gonna have a little fur coming down this way, like that. I'll go get it later, okay? And then, Hi, you guys, can you, sorry for the drop off from my Zoom. I don't know what happened. Tristan, can you make me host? I think you're the host now. I cannot, I am? Okay, alrighty. All right, back to my drawing. Okay, so we stop here, right? So this is the tail of the bird. See, this is only an outline. We didn't do anything else. We just do an outline. So this is the lake, right? And then we're going to have the leg this way, like a little crawl coming out. Okay. We don't, don't care about the details yet. Okay. Because we're going to color pencil it later. So something like that. And then we're going to have another one coming, sticking out the other side. Okay. So just doing some claw out here like this, we're going to pen color pencil it later. And now I want to have a little wood panel across so that he's sitting on something. Okay. I want you to, I want you guys to, to catch up till here and then we color pencil it. Okay. Don't worry about the eye yet too, because we don't need the eye until later. Okay. So I want you to, to do just the outline of the bird. Do the outline. Just that the, the tail have to be a little bit thicker, okay? Make sure you have your bird drawn outline first. You guys okay with the outline yet? 
Any question? Just a, a wood panel. It's straight. It's not curved. It's curved. No, no, it's not. It is curved. It's not curved. A little bit straight. Okay, here. Because my my paper is not straight earlier. Okay. There you go. Anyone else join? Aiden and um, Avery, you guys doing okay? And Zoe? Yep. Okay. Don't. Don't be shy, okay? So if, if you guys can cannot catch up, let me know. Because all these kids here are already with us for a while, so they know the process, how to do a, a simple um, drawing. Oh, we have Kirsten and Trevor. Mimi and Trevor, are you guys joining? I can't see your faces. We are doing a colorful bird with color pencil. So I want you guys to draw, um, make sure the outline first before we jump onto the color pencil, okay? Show me a thumbs up if you have finished the outline. It's okay, take your time. I know I did it really fast. Oh, Aiden, you finished your outline already? Oh, good job. Mei Mei, good morning. This is Kirsten, and we have Trevor. Maybe we have two, um, three new students today. We have Zoe, we have um, Aiden, and Avery. So we have Vivian today. We have Levi's and Lucas, Kaden and Kara, and Ida. I can't hear you, Mimi. Unmute yourself. All right, so make sure you get all the color pencil ready. Hello. Hi. So catch up with the outline Rain first. Okay? Light. It's okay. I, I want you guys to catch up right now. So we already started the drawing. Do the, do the outline now. Okay. So do the about a quarter down of the page, just the outline of the bird. Good job, Tristan. I like your outline. Um, can you move it down a little bit because I can't see the top. A little bit down. Okay. See it now? Can you see it now? Yeah. Okay, good job. Okay. So outline first, and then I want you guys to sharpen your color. First two, light blue and dark blue. Sharpen your color pencil. Okay, while waiting for the others to join. Okay, I'm going to mute myself because we're going to sharpen our pencil, okay? Okay, we are back. So sharpen your pencil, the two, make sure it's really, really sharp like this, okay? I want you guys to, to learn how to use color pencil to draw, um, draw bird's fur. And then I'm gonna sharpen my purple. Purple is pretty sharp, so I don't have to sharpen it. <clears throat> You guys have your color pencil um, or, sh or pencil sharpen already? Make sure you sharpen them. Okay, good job, Ari and Aiden. Mimi and Trevor, let me know you are at the outline part. So don't worry about the eye. Make sure that the bird have a, a big rounded tummy on the left, okay? And I'm gonna start. Everyone done with the outline, right? Except Trevor and Meme. Zoe, you done with the outline? Good job. Ida, thumbs up. Good job. Vivian? Good. Kaden and Kara, done with the outline? Good. Livas and Lucas? Yep. Good job. All right. 
妹妹 ，Trevor， you guys doing okay？ Any question on my outline drawing? Okay, I think they're doing good. Okay, so we're gonna start on the top of the head. Okay, so look at what I'm doing with the. Can I have it? Oh, you need it. Okay, it's okay. I got it. So I'm gonna start with the top part of the head. It's one line. Okay, right. So you try to cover the pencil line now. Okay, I want you to do the same stroke. You know, I'm doing the same stroke. Me going this way. My color pencil. You see how I'm doing the stroke this way, Kristen? Yeah. So you see the the rounded top. Try to do the same stroke going this way. Going to like a rounded top. Always do color pencil in the same direction if you can. Okay. After I do about a quarter of this, the top area. I'm gonna have the eyes right here, okay? So I'm gonna use my pencil now, okay? I'm gonna do a, a shape of the eye here, right next to the tip, okay? It can be a little bit like this. It can be a little bit bigger. So I I have my eyes a little bit bigger here, okay? But I want it to be a little bit smaller inside, which is a little shape, the same shape. I want to leave a dot of white. Okay, looks like an angry bird. This one. I don't want it to be too pointy now. I don't want it to be too angry, so I'm gonna sharpen this. I mean, round it this part, so it won't be that scary. Okay, so after we do that. Don't worry about it. So I'm gonna keep coloring. You see the eyes area. I want to keep coloring the top, but I want you to stop about a quarter out to do the shape of the eyes. Okay. About here at the eye. Okay. It can be a little bit bigger or smaller, up to you. The one that I have. Yesterday is a little bit smaller eye, but it's okay. Yeah, that's a good size. You want it to make it a little bit bigger. Just add the outline. Good job, Kristen. So add the eye first before we start continuing with the blue. Okay, Trevor, Mei Mei, you done with the outline? No. It's okay. Take your time. Vivian, you add your eyes. Good. Everyone, add their eyes of the bird. Yep. Okay, we're gonna start. Tristan, add the eye. Don't have to be too big. Okay, I'm gonna continue. Color the top here. So keep doing the blue. Make sure you cover all the pencil line. Okay, if you have a pencil line on top, make sure you cover it. Okay. Doing the same direction, always do the color pencil same direction. You can't cover the pencil. What do you mean? Try to. Yeah, don't 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 make it harder, Kristen. Don't don't try to make it harder. It's it's okay. After that, we can actually erase it if you want. We cannot can cover it. Okay. After we do that, I'm gonna add another dark blue. This is my darker blue. See, this is the two different color that I have: light blue and dark blue, right? So pick the darker blue. And continue doing the same stroke. Okay, we're adding two colors here. Okay, same stroke means going up to the top and then come down like a rainbow shape. Keep doing the same stroke over and over again. You know when you cut do color pencil, you will see see through the paper, the white paper, right? Try to cover the white paper as much as you can. And you show the stroke of fur, the bird fur, by by sharpening your pencil. Okay, that's why every time you do your color pencil stroke, you always use the sharper end of the pencil. You see how how's different when I do press it down and then do the stroke like this. You see how my my pen my my hand 
coming this way. You see that? Even from one, one side only, you can tell the stroke of every pencil, color pencil going left to right, left to right. Okay. And then I'm go back to my light blue. Good job, Tristan. And then go back to my light blue and then continue with the stroke coming this way. I know that you only do until here. So you need to continue, right? So when you do continue, you do the middle part here and then do the stroke this way. Okay. So from here, from the eyes area, it can be small stroke now because the fur from the eyes area is like this. Right? It's coming down this way. You see that? You see how I do my stroke? It's like a starburst coming out from the eyes. But in the same stroke of the head. See? Don't try to color pencil the whole thing, okay? Levi's and Lucas, you know what I mean by stroke at a time? So do not color the whole body yet. I don't want you to do coloring. We're doing stroke at a time. I know it takes a while, but it looks very realistic, right? You can see the fur coming down. You see how I do my, my stroke one at a time? Keep doing the same stroke this way to fill up all the space. Okay, after we do that, we're gonna add the blue, darker blue, okay? Good job, Tristan, it's really pretty. So bad. No, it's good, it just takes take a while. Maybe you wanna do a, a, a darker blue, that's really light, can't really see it. Maybe you wanna add a darker blue, okay? You see how I'm coming down now? Because it's coming down this way, the rainbow shape is always come down to to do it like this right and i'm gonna add my dark blue now see add like this okay see this you see the difference between the two, this two tip right this is a little bit sharper so this is a little blunt so i'm gonna sharpen this pencil so I want you to keep sharpening your pencil, okay? This is very important, okay? If you don't have a sharper tip, you won't get lines. So full of spots. Yeah, you will do like coloring like the top, okay? So this is the difference. I want you to, uh, let me show you. Uh, can I have a piece of paper? Yeah. See, this is a piece of paper, right? If you, if you don't sharpen it, you will do this, right? If you sharpen it, this is the line. So I don't want to, I don't want to see this. This is called coloring. We're not doing coloring. We're doing stroke. It means you draw a line at a time. You see the difference, everyone? We're not doing this. We're doing stroke. Okay. So I want you guys to tell the difference. So I'm, we're doing stroke with the sharpened color pencil. So again, I'm doing my darker blue now. I'm add on to the lighter blue. Okay. Keep doing this. Until you feel all the fur on the top with the blue, just then keep going. Good job. After we do that, we're coming down from, from the top. You see how I'm doing my stroke down right now? Because the, the fur is coming down this way now. It's no longer the, the rounded shape, right? So we're coming down this way. Fill up the, top, the bottom part here with dark blue. And I'm going back with my light blue and keep going with the light blue. So it's a combination of two tone of blue. See that? I have an angry bird. Angry looking bird this morning. Okay, so, so keep going this way until you fill up about here. See how I keep continue my stroke by just doing lines. If you do coloring, it won't look realistic. It looks like a coloring bird.
Okay, make sure everyone sharpen your pencils, okay? If you think you, you can't do lines anymore, that means you need to sharpen, okay? Remember to add the dark blue crystal, not only the... Okay. Keep adding it. You see the top part here? It's a lot of white showing, right? You don't want to do that. You don't want to do that. So you want to keep doing it, the stroke until it cover all the white. Just don't see the white anymore. So go back to your top. If you see a lot of white, see a lot of white here. Try to cover with the. What are you doing? Okay, we continue here. You see, on top here. Still, have, you can see a little bit of white over here. So I want to cover it more. You can keep adding the darker blue and the lighter blue so that it cover all the white. But you, you want us to see some strokes coming down too. Strokes of lines. See that? I did not color. I did not go go in and color it. I do stroke. But but you can tell if you add all the different lines and stroke, it it cover all the white, right? See that? Be patient, okay? I want you guys to be patient on doing this. After we do the blue until here, I'm going to start another new color. Okay, everyone's going to have a different tone of blue and different tone of green, right? Because everyone have different colors, color um, pencil set. Okay, after we do that, it's green. I'm going to add green now. Okay, take your time. If you're not finished the blue yet, it's only a little bit of the head area. You see the eye area, I have a little bit of white. You see the dot of white, so I'm going to go in and make sure there's no white. Okay. Very nice, Justin. Good job. It's so bad. I can't see no, it's eyes. nice. Keep going. You haven't finished yet. But your stroke is good. Keep going. Like why you always say your work is bad? It's not bad at all. Okay, you just need patience to finish the all the stroke. Okay, I think I'm done on the head area. What about everyone? You guys finished on the head? No one is done, but Ida is doing good. You're almost there. Good job. Keep going. I think you still have a little bit more on the bottom here. So when you do the bottom, make sure it's coming down straight now, right? I'm coming down straight like this, okay? Aiden and Avery, you guys doing okay? Can someone show me? Okay, Trevor's showing me. Okay, right now I'm going to add spotlight. Trevor, good job, Trevor. Wow, look at your angry big bird head. <laughs> good job, Trevor. What about Mei Mei? Are you done? You want to show me yours? Good job. Make sure you have two tone there. I cannot tell there's two tone. That's good. Make sure you have two tone, uh, two tone okay? Okay, this is Tristan. Okay, good job, Tristan. It's bad. You keep going. The, the, you can still see a lot of white, okay? Kaden, want to show me? Okay. Kaden, your turn. One at a time, one at a time. I cannot see both. One at a time. Okay, I stand, I can still see a lot of white, Kaden, on yours. Can you cover the white and also the pencil line, okay? No pencil line on the outline, okay? Try to cover the pencil line. And Kara now? Okay, same thing with yours. I can still see a lot of uh, white on top and also the pencil line. Try to cover it, okay? But good job. I can see all the strokes. Who else want to show me? Oh, Aiden want to show me. Okay, good. Hang on. Aiden. Good job, Aiden. That's a really cool head of yours. Good job. 
but make sure you um you know the top part here i know you make some mistake right on top right try to erase it it's okay you can use eraser to erase it okay good job Ari. what about you you want to show me yours it's okay don't be shy don't be shy it's okay he doesn't want to show okay it's okay no worry all right who else want to show vivian okay hang on to show me is just want to make sure that you guys are on the right track okay we're not comparing good job vivian good stroke i love it even the blending is good good job vivian okay who else ida your turn oops what's going on okay ida it's your turn nice good job okay levi's your turn hang on let me remove you okay levi's where are you okay good um cover your top pencil line with the blue okay but you did good good job what about um lucas nice awesome good job guys i need to see zoe now zoe you ready to show me okay can i see yours flip to the camera i can see can you do it again there you go good awesome good job very good tristan good job zoe very nicely done okay now we continue to the green okay so let me go back to my spotlight you guys can see my spotlight right tristan mm -hmm. okay what's going on why how come i can't see my own okay all right so now i just want to make sure everyone sharpen your green now so pick two green a lighter green and a darker green so look how blonde it is i'm gonna sharpen it okay so sharpen your green that's our next color i'm gonna mute myself Okay, we just finished sharpen our green. So pick two green. So the first one is the lighter one. I'm going to use start combine. So we're blending the blue over here. So see, same, same thing. The floor coming down in one direction. Okay. So the direction is coming down this way. So this is the back of the fur, right? So see how fast I'm going this way? Just like coloring, but it's going straight like this. See that? Right? Keep going, Tristan, with the blue. Your blue is too short. See how I'm getting the line down? Right? After we do the light green, I'm going to add the darker green. Same thing with the darker green is over here, this side. See it doing lines like this? Okay, keep going down like lines. Like this. Make sure your so, make sure your color pencil so is sharpened. So it's light green and dark, right? Yes. Make sure you don't color it. Tristan, you're oh, yeah. getting the coloring. Do not do coloring, okay? We're doing strokes. I'm adding the green. Keep adding the line. 
All right, I have, I have some eraser from the bottom. So make sure the lines are straight down this way. Remember, sharpen your pencil, okay? Keep sharpening your pencil. So I wanted to do the bent, Tristan, you're coloring. So make sure your lines like this down, okay? <laughs> no, 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 you don't have to do too hard. Do it, do it have, very gentle. Do it I know, but do it later on top of it. If, if you don't, don't hurt your hands, okay? See, I'm very gentle, even doing the lines down. Very gentle down. Try to cover it like this. I'm not using a lot of strength, okay? See how blend the two green blend together? Right? Do it slowly. I'm blending the two green together. And same here. And try to cover the pencil line. So no pencil line showing. Right? Do the stroke longer so that it's not, you're not going to hurt yourself, Kristen. Do the stroke longer so that you go down that way. Yeah. Even longer. And going down in, in this way, Tristan. Look, because of the back of the, of the fur. We're going this way, especially this side here, yes. On the left side, we try to cover this way, okay? You see my, my lines here? I'm doing a curve here because this is the back of the green. Yeah? So it's like floating this side. Oops, I just broke this. I'm going to sharpen it. I just broke my lead. Okay, I'm going to mute myself for a little bit, okay? Okay, all right, so continue with your stroke, blending with the two green together, same thing as you as you're doing it on the top for the blue and the light, uh, the dark blue and the light blue okay same technique. We're not doing anything new it's just different color. Okay about here. We're going to stop about here. We're going to add different color after that okay. Make sure you cover all the pencil line and all the white spots. Yeah, I need to do dark green. Yeah, and then keep going a little bit longer. Okay, the next color, I'm gonna do the tummy area. I'm gonna fill it with the, oh, let me charge my computer. That's what I did. Okay. We keep adding. You see the blending part, make sure it cover very nicely so that there's no gaps between the blue and the green. Oh, very nice green, Tristan. Some people pick the darker green, some people pick the lighter green. Oh. Okay, make sure you're blending together, okay? So some of them are green. Tristan, you're, you only have this what about here? You can yeah. add some green? Yeah, dark green is a lot. Okay, got it. But you, you need to add another green here on top. So that, uh, not, not that dark green, a lighter one, like this one. Interesting. Yeah, that one. That works. About here, we stop around here, like a patch of fur on top here. Okay, we stop here. So our next color I'm gonna sharpen is orange. We have three colors on the tummy. Maybe four. And maybe a red. Okay, I'm gonna have a darker orange, lighter orange, a yellow, and a red. Okay, those are my tummy color. Okay. 
And the purple. Uh, not the tummy. Remember, try to try to sharpen your pencil. Yeah, the purple is on the back. I'm doing the tummy now. Oh, oh, the tummy is or. Yeah, tummy is like. Five. Say that again. It's not five. Uh oh. You want another charger? Can you go get it from from my room? Yeah, the one on the ground, the pink one. Oh, this 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 one. I'm not sure it's fast enough. Go get the pink one. Okay, so this is the four colors. Anyone's not finished the green part? I don't want you guys to left behind. So I wanted to make sure everyone finished the green. Aiden and Avery, you finished the green part? Yeah? Good. Vivian's still doing the green. It's okay, take your time. Ida, still working on the green. Zoe, you're doing good on the green? Good. Levi's and Lucas, are you guys finished the green? Good. Kaden and Kara, doing okay with the green? Okay. So make sure you sharpen your pencil like Trevor and Maymay is doing right now and Vivian. Keep sharpening. You have to be very sharp like this, okay? At least like this. All right. So the first thing I'm going to use is the middle part of the the middle orange. This is the middle orange. So I'm going to Okay, so you see the tummy is going this way, right? So my stroke is coming down same stroke like this. See that? Make sure you follow the the stroke of the shape of the body. Okay? You always follow the same shape. Kristen, you found it? It's on the ground, pink. So to keep, keep doing this stroke and cover your pencil line because this is the outline, right? Try to cover it. Keep doing this, coming down this way. You see how I come down my stroke with, yeah. yes? Yeah. No. Keep coming down this way. All right, keep going. Let's put it in. Okay. It's just at three percent now. Okay, I'm gonna keep going with the middle of orange here. So don't worry about the peak yet. So we come going down this way here. And I'm gonna add a darker orange. Same thing, same technique. Try to cover the pencil lines here. See that? Just that you're coloring. Don't do that. I told you not to. No, no, don't don't do coloring. I told you not to do coloring. You even doing the white, you use the same technique, the stroke to covering it, okay? No coloring. If you do coloring, you, you're gonna cover all your stroke that you've done before. You're wasting it, right? So doing the same stroke, coming down. You don't have to do it so hard, Kristen. I don't even hurt my arm at all. We are doing stroke we're not doing like killing ourselves to do the coloring on the paper but it's so hard Look, you see how i do my stroke do it slowly okay keep going down i'm going to fill up my Bottom here it's with orange. stroke. Which orange? Oh, the orange is here. Wait, wait, there's mm -hmm. orange here. Just then. There's so many orange here. Look. I like this. It's the same. It's the same set, Tristan. It's just a smaller set. It's the same color. 
Pick the same name. Listen, come on, don't waste yeah, time. I guess what is the neon? No, no neon. It's not going to be realistic if you have neon color. Okay? And there's no good orange. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. I have to. I have the other one. You need a sharpie. I know. Okay. Keep doing the same spot. So make sure you have uh, this area empty. Okay, because this is the back of the fur. We don't. We're not going to cover it until later. Okay. So until here, we're going to stop. So don't go all the way. To the right, because this area is going to be the. I'm going to use my pencil to show you. So this area, we're going to have a little line here. I want to make sure that you don't cover it. Okay. Make sure you have this butt, the butt area. There's another piece of fur coming down. Okay. Make sure I don't want you to. Just then. Do you do it too fast? Why do you cover it like coloring? Make sure you do the, Tristan, look, look, look. Tristan, look, down like this, one stroke like this. Round, stroke like this. I want you to do stroke like this, okay? If you do it too fast, you're, you're doing the coloring technique again, right? Doing the stroke one at a time. If you do stroke one at a time, you cover the white, no matter what, right? You just have to be patient. Especially this round area, it's a lot bigger than the top here area here. So if you don't do stroke, it doesn't look like fur. Okay? You see how slow I'm doing my stroke? But it will cover the white no, no matter what. Right? Keep going. See, I go back on the top. I'm coming down with stroke. I will cover all the white, just like coloring. But you said you're not supposed to color. Just like coloring. I did not say coloring. <laughs> I said, just like coloring, I did not do the coloring, like go, going in and then do cover the white like this. I'm trying to do the stroke, one stroke at a time to cover the white. That's a big difference. I know you guys, especially the boys, no patient, but it's okay, okay? We just have to do it one at a time to cover it. You can see the difference if I'm talking what I'm talking about. If you do the coloring, it, it, it won't show all the fur coming down. See how realistic it looks like fur right now? Not realistic. You have oh you have the yellow on the underneath. That's I like it. I'm gonna add some yellow too. Look. But the red is just bad. See, I'm gonna add some yellow. Tristan, give me a good idea on the bottom part. Let's have some sh yellow showing. See that? Like that. So it's coming down. I have red, darker orange, and then middle orange. And then and down below, I'm going to have a little bit of yellow. <sighs> the red sucks. Just then. Keep sharpening. I'm going to mute myself again. All right, see I add some yellow on the bottom part here. After I add the yellow, I'm going to I'm going to go back to my middle orange to cover it a little bit. See that? It's like a gradient of yellow, orange, and then red. I'm going to sharpen again. You see how blended my 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 middle orange look like right now? That means it's time to sharpen. It's okay, but you can have it as a guidance, okay? So this is my middle orange I just sharpened. Keep adding 
You see the middle part here? Let me show you, zoom in a little bit here. Okay, you see this area here? Have some stroke of white showing through from the paper, right? So try to go back in and then do stroke, more stroke to cover it. Ah, I just broke it again. Again, let me sharpen it again. Try not to do it too hard because you're gonna keep breaking the lead. See what I did. Okay, let's hear. Go back and then cover all the white and show a little bit of yellow in the bottom part here. See, I'm almost done. So you have a little bit see through yellow, Tristan. That's very cool. I like it. So now go back to my darker orange. And then try to finish this last part here. Very nice. I like it. I can see all your stroke, Tristan. Good job. So from the bottom part here, I want you to come down and then all the fur will go straight off, cover the the, the pencil drawing. Okay? The pencil line over here, cover it. Try to go out of the the line and then come out with the fur sticking out in the bottom like this see that i'm going this let me zoom in so you can see it see so come down try to do the stroke out of out from this pencil line i can go in and and, and actually erase the bottom one because the bottom one is really dark pencil line i don't want it to have any pencil line as possible so I'm going to erase the bottom part and then cover it more. Okay. Good job, Tristan. Almost done. Make sure you leave this part here, okay? You see, I have a, a, a this part here. Make sure you leave it just to follow that picture. See, I'm almost there. So I'm going to add my last bit is I'm going to use a red, okay? Good job. Is that... Trevor's nice Trevor good job I like the blending of the the two colors or three colors so I'm going to add some red on the side here okay you see how I how sharp my my pencil is right I'm going to add some fur coming in same thing just adding red lines If I see any white area, I'm going to go in and use my um, red and do some lines and cover it. See, see, you can see through a little bit of red here. For Tristan, it's yellow. It's very nice, Tristan. I like your blending. You see, I go back in. Very good. I like your blending. You see, I go in with my red. I go in and cover all the red, uh, all the white area, sorry. All the white with my red color pencil. So you can see, look, let me zoom in for you to see, right? You can see the fur coming out. See how, the, how, I, how I add it on? It's using a red, go in and try to cover all the white. And the pencil line. Yeah, my yellow. That's that's yeah. that's very nice. Very nice, Tristan. Good job. So you put an effort on everything you do. It looks good, right? Yeah, I put a lot of effort on <laughs> I know. Not not those kind of <laughs> effort, Tristan. Okay, see see how I add my fur is so pretty. This looks like the colors blending really well. Okay. After we do that, we're almost there. You see, the whole entire bird 
you already done about 50% of it. Right? Maybe more than 50%. Yeah, more than 50%. So you have the big tummy cover. You have the big head, a patch of the, bo- um, the, the back area. And then we have another patch and then the tail. And you're almost done. And then the, and then the peak is very and then easy. The branch. So I'm going to go back up here to add some lines of the red. Okay. Make sure you cover all the white spot. Okay, who want to show me your orange tummy? Mine. Okay, this is twist and blending. Look, very colorful, isn't it? Yeah, very good. It's you did a really, really good job today. Look, this is the blending that he, she shows some white, uh, not white, yellow. He, he shows some yellow see-through coming out from the fur. Isn't that cool? I like this blending. Okay, so who want to show me yours? Okay, let's see, Aiden. Hang on, Aiden. Where are you? Everything's awesome. Okay, here you go. Good job. Keep going. Good job. So add some red. I can see a, a lot of orange and yellow, but can you add some red? See how I add my fur? Some red. Make sure you sharpen your pencil, okay? Uh, Everybody, okay. Are you going to show me yours this time? Uh, no, hold on. Sure. Um, Sorry. I, I think it's because um, I mix the colors a little too much. I think because I mix um, all the colors. It's okay. Bed. It's okay. If you mix it by accident, it's okay. It's okay. So add some red now. Add some red now, okay? Every, can you show me yours? I just want to make sure you're doing the right thing, okay? Can you show me yours, Every? Am I frozen? He doesn't want to show me. It's okay. Maybe later. Okay. Levi's and Lucas, your turn. Show me your orange tummy. How come I can't see him? That spotlight. The one is really weird today. Okay, Levi's and Lucas. I can't see them. Yeah. What's wrong? Okay, hang on, okay? I don't know what's going on. Can you guys hear me? I've been having a hard time to connect. I don't know what's going on. I can't see you guys. Just wait until a little bit later what's wrong with the wi-fi you guys can see me okay right can someone speak i cannot see you guys or, or hear you guys can someone trevor can you say something trevor yeah are they here yeah. can you hear me and see me yes uh, yeah oh, I can weird i can't see you guys Okay, good, good, good. I'm just gonna continue, okay? I'm not gonna see you guys now, but I want you make maybe you will come back up. Okay. Your, your screen. Okay, continue with your coloring. No, so I got, I got kicked out of the meeting now. Are you okay now? Can you can you jump back? Okay. There's something wrong with our Wi-Fi back here. Okay. So I'm gonna continue with the back area here, okay? So the back area. What color is that? Can you show me the, the other picture I did? Purple. It's purple? Purple and a little bit of red. Can I see? Can I see? Purple. So I'm going to have this purple, OK? This, oh, you guys are back. Now I can see you guys. So weird. OK. So I have some purples here. See what color I have. I have purple, blue, and a lot of orange in the, in the bottom part, OK? So I'm going to have purple first. So let me sharpen. OK, so I'm going to do purple here. After we do this part, and then we, we're going to see all your tummy, OK? So same thing, purple. I'm, going, I'm doing lines going this way, right? Line going this way. Okay. 
careful with the camera, please. Can you move it over the other side? Okay, I can see everyone now. That is so weird. Okay. So try to try to do the, the purples here, and then we're gonna add some blues on the side. So make sure that just then too fast. Do it slowly. No point of doing fast. I'm gonna hurt your arm again. Yes, doing slowly. Don't ruin it. You did you've been doing really good. Continue, okay. See, but this side here is the back. So the fur is going this way. So we follow the, sh the shape and also the direction of the fur going down, right? So like this one is curvy, but this one is straight down on the back. You see the difference? You see I'm doing short lines here. You can add a little bit longer line if you want, but make sure you follow the shape. Right, I'm gonna add a little bit more blue, which is the lighter blue. It's so good. Keep adding. And then on the top here, I want you guys to blend the green and the blue together. See? That's how you blend the two colors together by adding lines on top of each other. Okay? Take your time. Again, I always say that there's no right or wrong when you're doing art. You just follow the instruction and then follow the direction, you, you'll be doing fine. Wow, look at that purple, Tristan. Good job. You need to sharpen that. Yep, I'm going to mute myself. Okay, just sharpen my purple. So I try to cover all the all the white area. See that? Purple and blue, and then some orange at the bottom here. So that you see through. See through. You can see through the orange from, from the bottom. You see that? You add some orange on the bottom and then on top you put back the purple. See, I still have a lot of white going on in the middle, right? I don't want that. So go back to your white and then do blue lines on top. So you cover all the white. You see the difference between this and this, right? This two, this is covered with all the orange and yellow, right? This, you can still see a lot of white spot, tiny little lines, right? So I'm going to go back in and cover all the white spot. By not coloring, by doing the same stroke technique. That's a huge difference. See that? Keep going. Tristan, are you done? Tristan is dumping all the, um, the waste from the sharpener. Because it's full. We've been shopping a lot, right? 
Make sure you sharpen your pencil. That's the whole thing. Lucas and Levi's, are you done? Already? The tail? <laughs> Come on, put, be careful with the cable. Okay. Continue sharpen. Make sure it's sharpen time to time. Okay. We are back in business. Our sharpener is it's clear. It's clear. It's empty. So we have a lot of. Yo, did you know it's so full? It was like this much. Wow. That's why it wasn't sharpening. I see. Okay, see, see the I bottom see part? Tristan, Tristan, you see the bottom part? I add a little bit of orange on the, on the bottom. Orange and red or just orange? Just orange. Yeah, put some orange and then you cover with the purple. Okay, now I'm ready to see everyone orange tummy and the, the last purple back. Okay, anyone want to show me yours? Get your hands up. So Levi's, it looks like you're done. Can I see? You're on spotlight now. Can I see yours, Levi? Nice. Good job. Uh, for Lucas, you have a lot, a lot of white spot. You need to cover it, okay? All of the spot. You see a lot of white, you need to cover it, okay? Good job, Levi. Okay, who else want to show me? Aiden, have you done yours? Yeah, you want to show me? Let's see. Nice. You still haven't finished it, but do the blending correctly. You yeah, it, have a lot of white just, spots. Um, I colored everything a little too big, so uh, that's why the little purple area is like really like small. And then, and then I'm erasing the orange because it's um on the tail. It's okay. Don't worry about it. It's it doesn't have to be exact portion, okay? Every bird is different, so it's okay. okay. So continue cover all the white spot, okay? No worry. Kaden and Kara, your turn. One at a time. Nice. Look at that. Good job. Good job, Kaden. What about yours, Kara? Look at that. I like your, your big tummy. Good job. Continue with your purple. You still have a lot of white spot, okay? Co try to cover all the white spot. Okay, Vivian, you ready to show me? No? Okay, Ida? Let me see yours upside down. Can you flip it? Can you flip it the other way so that I can see it properly? Thank you. Thank you. Good job. Very nicely done, Ada. Okay, who else? Dip, 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 dip. Maybe and Trevor. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, look at that big fat bird. Good job, Trevor. It did really good. I love all your strokes. Good job. Okay, Maymay's turn. All right, Maymay still need to continue on the bottom part. A lot of white still. Zoe, your turn. Can I see? Nice. Good job. Very nicely done, Zoe. Okay, now let's continue. Tristan, stop chatting. This part here, this part here, I still can see a white spot. Can you cover it? Okay, and the green, the top part of green. So try to cover all the white spots. I still have a little bit more of a white spot too myself. So I'm going to cover before I jump onto the next part. See, it's not that hard, right? It looks hard when you first see the painting, I'm sure. But it's not that bad. You guys can well, do it. It's like the easiest thing here. You think so? Yes, in my opinion. All right, I'm done with this part here. So I'm going to add the green tail 
My green tail will be a little bit of darker green. Yellow is basically white in consistency. Yeah. And if you don't know if you rub yellow hard enough, yeah. you can erase basically any color. That's good. So, like, so, like a, I accidentally colored a little bit of green over here. I just used yellow. And it's oh, blended. good job. So, so it's basically blended. Very cool. I'm going to add a little bit more green on the, onto this patch so I cover all the white. I'm still not happy with the white spot here. So I'm going to go back. See, good thing about color pencil, you always can go back and try to touch up more. Right? If you're not happy with certain area, I can go back in and keep adding. See, I'm adding the light green on here. So I always can cover all the white spot. You see, I have no more white spot after I use the green. Sometimes you're using the same color again and again, it won't cover the, the right, um, the white spot. So I want to go back and do some light green. So I have some light green here. Okay, so the bottom tail, this tail here, I'm going to use three colors. Light green, darker green, and even a more darker green. See, this is, this is very dark. This is called dark green. <laughs> And I have a true green. And this is another light green. Okay. So I'm going to sharpen. I'm going to do stroke. Same, same so here. Light green. light green, dark green, two dark green, two tonal different, three tonal green. So I'm going to doing the same stroke here because the tail is this way. So follow the stroke like this. Okay. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to, because of the light green, I'm going to cut, erase the tail with the pencil, erase the pencil line. I don't want to show the pencil line at the bottom. So I'm going to erase the pencil line, but you know the tail looks like, right? So it's okay to erase the pencil line because you're going to have the lines adding on with the stroke that I'm going to create right now. See, keep adding the lines. See, Same here with that green. That green. And then I have another type of green. See, I have three types of green here. Auntie Kathy. Yes, Vivian? My book's in the bathroom. Sure, go ahead. So See, I keep adding the green. I have three type of green. At the bottom part here, I'm going to do a circle, kind of like a circle shape, half circle shape by using the stroke. You see, I, I erased the, you erased the pencil line too? Good job. Okay, now oh, you curved it at the bottom. Yeah, the curve it at the bottom. Good job. See, I have I'm going this is only my first layer, right? I'm gonna add on top. See, I'm gonna keep adding. I'm gonna shop it now. Remember to sharpen your pencil, okay? This whole technique is sharpening pencil, adding layers by layers. Just sharpen my pencil. Every time you see it, when I mute myself, it's sharpening pencil. Now I don't want you guys to hear that. Loud noise. I'm not sure everyone has the electric um, sharpener. I hope you do. This is so, so much easier and faster. More efficient. Yeah. I have this sharpener since I was in college. You know that, Tristan? College? Yeah. It was a long time ago since I got here. From Panasonic? Yeah. My favorite. Brand. Okay, so I'm adding 
more darker green and then come out here is like lighter on the bottom here right and then i'm going to add my lightest green on top the lime green i call it almost done you see the whole entire bird you never thought you can finish it right i did good <laughs> Wow, look at that blending, Tristan. Good job. <sighs> Very good. See, I'm not sure what color pencil you guys have, but this is the brand that I love. Yeah, our, what is it called? What is it called? Uh, tell me. Oh, this is the brand. I have the, Prisma color, Prisma color. Yeah, Prisma color is the one that I love, the color pencil. So I will let you guys know that if that's a sale, okay, on Amazon. Time to time they have sales, so I will let you guys know. Oh, yeah, this is the really good. He still didn't get me the gift. I know because we still have this set. I want my own. <laughs> if you if you keep doing your color pencil like this, I will get you your own set. Okay. Can I just do more color pencil art sessions? Well, you like color pencil more? Yes, color pencil. But I want you. I want to teach everybody different media, not only color pencil. Who, I, whose I, favorite I, media is color pencil? Me. How do you me? Tristan, Ida. No Kara, one else. Kara. Kara. Kaden. Kara and Kaden, really? What about Vivian? You don't like color pencil? I like watercolor better. Oh, smart girl. See, you are like me. My favorite color media is watercolor it's not it's not easy to control watercolor and exactly. I, my our session is to teach everybody everyone different media not only color pencil but yeah, i will no, but can we do more color pencil uh we'll see it also depends on my mood of what media we use doing every week okay so if you're angry you want to do? <laughs> it's not angry or yeah. happy would mean it can be oh i feel like doing what media that week oh yeah what do you want to do next week i haven't thought about that yet i just got back okay let me think. let me think about it think. think think i also add i draw a dog again remember we did a dog with a color pencil with those strokes remember you want to do a dog yeah that, with, with a lot of colors with the strokes okay Okay, continue with yellow. I'm I'm adding yellow to yellow. my I'm adding yellow to my tail. Okay, so if you see a lot of the white spot, add some yellow to cover it. See, using big brain. You know, you know, you know what this the tail looks like to me? Yeah. Cucumber. Wait, 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 what? <laughs> it looks like cucumber. Oh yeah. It looks like a cucumber at the end. Look, isn't it? Dude, it looks. It doesn't look like a cucumber at the end. It looks like. A cucumber from your whole tail. <laughs> okay, my cucumber tail is done. Nice one. Okay, now the the most important part, which is the eyes. Oh. I already told you guys, drawing animals, insects. The most important part is the eye. Why? Just then why? Because they can see. And it's black? <laughs> no, because it will tell you how the animal is like the main focus is the eye area. Okay? How? Because it's the whole part of the, the, the drawing or the painting. Okay. This, the, but the eye is so small. Okay, so hands up if you finish the tail. Me. Ida's finish. Aiden finish. Every finish. Kaden and Kara finish. Levi Lucas, are you done with the tail? Yep. Vivian still working on it? Or just, just sharpening? Okay. Mimi and Trevor want to show me yours? Do you have a cucumber tail too? Nice. Good job. One is fat and one is long. Good job, Trevor. Good job, Mimi. I like that. Zoe, can you show me yours? nice good job so you see the blending between the tail part and here you have a lot of white spot okay so try to cover it so it's blend together so there's no gaps 
You don't see blue, a, a big chunk, green, a big chunk. It's all blending together, okay? Make sure all your gaps is filled up so it's, you don't see all the white spot, okay, Zoe? Good job. You've been doing really good. Ida, can I see your drawing upside down? There you go. Nice. Good job. Very nicely done. Okay, who else want to show me? Kaden and Kara? Let me see a spotlight. Wow, look at your big fat tail, Kara. It's like a bean. <laughs> That's really cute. What about your... And Kaden is a small one too. It's a finger. <laughs> good job. I like the blending. Uh, Very good. One is a finger. Nice. <laughs> Okay, now we're going to focus on, oh, Aiden want to show me his. Hang on. Nice. It's okay. You have a small bird. It's just okay. It doesn't have to be a big fat one, right? Everyone, oh, yeah, your tummy is, wait, yeah, everyone wait, is a different bird. Your, your tummy is like this. Yeah, mine is like a pregnant bird. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. No, like Toby? Toby? Yeah, Toby. Are you laughing Toby. at our Toby? So don't laugh at Toby. So no, don't laugh at Toby. Okay, so we're going to do the eyes area. Okay, so I'm going to use a yellow on the outline here. Christian, are you focusing? Come on. Uh, yeah. No chatting. Orange. Same orange or yellow that you use. You can use an orange or yellow, but I prefer a, a sunflower yellow. Okay. Can I use orange? You see the outline here? And then I'm going to use black. Where's my black? My black. Did you take my black? No. This is black. Hmm? I thought all. No, I mean, if why you, you use dark blue? No, I use black. Okay. I have a black here. Investigate. Oh, it's black. There's a black flower over there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> no wonder I can't find my black. Okay. So make sure you have that white spot. Do not color it, okay? So this part here, we're doing coloring. This is only a small area. We're Oops, doing color. I accidentally colored it. Are you kidding me? It is so small. I told you to have it a little bigger. So you have a white but spot. It's okay. Just erase it. You don't ruin it. Can I see? Let's see how I fix it. What are you drinking? Okay, coffee. I'm gonna I'm gonna erase Tristan's eyes or how? Coffee. Okay, you just have to fix this area. Okay, fix the blue. Make your eyes a little bit bigger because your your eyes are so small, so that you you barely have mm -hmm. have area to be coloring. Okay, so make sure you color this part, and then you outline the. Outline the um, the yellow. You have to because you have to color it. I mean, you have to erase it. You see that? You see how a a drawing or a painting it looks alive when you put the eyes on it, right? It's huge different when you add the eyes. And then the second part we're going to do is the peak area. I'm going to color light yellow. I can't. Let me show you. This is already colored. So okay, I, can't, okay. I can't even see. Use the white. Where's the white? It's a white color pencil. Okay. Let me show you. I have this one right here. Oh, okay. This is my white. Keep going, guys, okay? Did you erase this? Tristan, stop. Why do you color this, Tristan? It's black. Huh? Mm. Keep get keep um doing the eyes part, okay guys? I'm trying to fix Tristan eyes for him. This is excellently colored the whole thing. Where's the black? Give me the black. The black Just then, stop.
Okay, I'm gonna do the light yellow on the peak area. Just then do the same thing. Please do not outline the peak yet, okay? Okay, there we go, look, we made it. Okay, good, good, good. So color the light yellow on the peak area, the whole thing. Listen, why you, why you do the outline? Please don't do outline, okay? Mm -hmm. I did not start it on the peak and then you start it on the peak by yourself. Follow instruction, wait for the instruction. Unless you know what you're doing. Okay, so it's color the whole thing yellow, very light yellow. This is the light yellow that I have. This is the light yellow that I have. Okay, and then after we do that, use the black. Is this black? Okay, black. Brown. And then we're gonna do coloring. Where is the black I gave you? This is mine. I'll pick it on the ground. You have your own black. You remember I gave you the black? Is that's oh. only bad for me. Sorry. Where's my black? Oh, right here. Imagine it fell again. Okay, so so I'll be doing the beak like this. You see how I coloring like this and going with the shape. You see the shape of the beak is this way, right? Just like a rainbow, but we're doing a half circle stroke like this. You see that? You see how I coloring it? It's follow it following the shape. Listen, are you following? So after we do that, we're gonna add some black lines over the head area. We're almost done. Right? After we do that, we're gonna keep going with the stroke. Good job, Kristen. Keep going like this. Same thing with the bottom part, but the bottom part I'm going to start coloring here. So leave some yellow area. Kristen, you see how I do the bottom part? Just follow this because you want it to highlight the beak. This is called the highlight of the beak coming out. See that? By adding black underneath. See that? I'm following the shape. You see that? There you go. So you highlight the whole beak. It's the whole head showing now. You see the difference? Yeah. Good. Very good. And then I'm at the bottom here, where the orange tummy is. I'm gonna add some black. This is the shadow. Do you know I colored it, my entire body so much? Yeah. And it's so it's waxed, so I can't get like it's, clean tip. You have to because you sharpen your pencil. If you sharpen it, it will go come down. Yeah. So and then over yeah. here, I'm gonna add a little curvy line over here. Okay. And I'm going to add my blue back here. See, this area, I'm going to have it blue. What are you doing? I'm adding the, the curvy line here. Oh. You see the curvy line? This part here. I paint this the first from a, 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 a photo of a bird. So the photo itself has this little curvy line on top here. After, so you do not show the black or the black's just there? No, right here. I'm going to add the blue no, back. Do you cover the black? No, you don't cover the black. What do you mean by cover the black? No, do you color, like color over the black? Or do you just leave the black like, as an outline there? Yes, as an outline there. Okay. As an outline, and then you move your, and then you add your blue over it. Okay? That's what I'm saying. You add your blue over yes, it. Yes, add your blue over it. Okay, you see this little curvy line up that I add here? Let me zoom it in so you can see. You see that? That's the end of the peak area, right? Now your bird look more realistic. 
Did you add the little curvy line? Good job. Okay. And then you add a little bit of black line on the top area. Those are the shadows again. Especially underneath the beak, some white, uh, some black coming out. Okay. Coming down, not coming out, coming down of the beak area. So there's some shadow. I'm going to add a little bit of. Kristen, can you just sit down and finish it? And then we're going to. black right? Right in the middle here. So those, those are the shadows. Kristen, look first. I'm not even finished. So there's a little bit of shadows here. And so that this is the back area, right? So if you add some shadows. In the back area, you see the different, this, you can separate the tummy area and the back area. So it's kind of like you're saying, this is the tummy. Yes. This is the tummy. And that is the back. So I add a shadow. And that is the neck and that is the head. And that all is over this area here. You see that I add a little bit of black, not a lot. Right? Okay. You see how realistic the bird looks like now? Pretty realistic. Pretty realistic, yeah. Okay, so the last part is the lake. Sit down, please stand. So the last part is branches. No, and the lake. So I'm gonna use Brown. two colors for my lake. Yeah, so one lighter brown and one Darker. chocolate. chocolate. So everyone's done with the beak. Anyone want to show me? Me. Yeah. Look, this is just a little bird. It's bad. It's pretty cool. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. It's bad compared to yours. Why? Why this is rounded, Tristan? Because it's a. Because he's heavy. He's so fat. <laughs> no. So then, no. Then he the don't down. don't do it curve, okay? Because it's it's gonna ruin your your composition of your drawing. Okay. He just ah, you just added a line, just a straight line. Why you do a curvy branch? He's fat. Laying the branch down. That doesn't make sense. <laughs> it's just a little bird. Just a little bird, so straight line, okay? All right, so we're going to add the brown, and then we're almost done. So the brown of the, the which, feet. Which is dark brown? Light, light brown. Light brown. Yep. Light umber. Light brown. And then I'm going to add different brown here. So the light brown first, and then dark brown on the top. Okay, can you see it? Let me zoom it in. Like this. So start with the light brown. And then add the darker brown by by drawing the hook or the claw, the claw of the, the bird, claw. the claw. <laughs> okay. Roar. The claw. The claw is stepping out. So that's why you don't do all the detail by just outline it and then you always use a color pencil to sharpen the claw. The claw. Uh, here you go. See? Nice one. You see my claw. Okay. I'm adding two colors into one. Okay, same thing with the the one in front. This is the one at the back. So that's why you can only see one lake. Same thing, adding this. The claw. There, there, it's back. 
Our Wi-Fi is not stable earlier today. I got kicked out. Tristan got kicked out once too. Okay. The crown. There you go. You see how each one is a little bit different. So I'm adding two, blending two brown together. Okay. And then I'm gonna do the that branch that he's standing. So let me zoom it out again. I like my bird better than the one I did last night. Okay. Probably because you're rushing. Because I'm rushing? Yeah, probably. And I'm tired too. Okay. So I'm gonna color my branch just with two same thing with two brown and then we're done. So I'm I'm coloring. So this is the coloring that I'm talking about. So you see how you see how different the coloring than doing the stroke. See, I'm coloring right now. I know you guys are excited to do the coloring. Finally, I can color. Right? It's called shading. <laughs> or shading. Do the do the shading or coloring. If you want to say it, coloring. Okay. Leave the leave this area a little bit white, Tristan. Don't cover the 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 legs yet. I'm not there yet. Okay, just do coloring all over the branches, and then I'm gonna show you how to do stroke of um, darker brown so that it looks like a branch. Can you continue? Focus. Yes. I'm Is ready. that brown? It looks like. It is brown. purple. So it's actually brown. It's it's very light brown. It's brown combined with pink. Yeah, it looks like a little purple pink pinkish brown. But when we color it harder, it will look like brown. I'm just shading it that side. Okay. I want to make sure that you pick the right brown. Okay, this is one type of coloring. It's called using the it's called holding the pencil at the end of the pencil and then do this. This is very light coloring, right? So color mm -hmm. pencil has a lot of different technique to finish on the paper. So I'm gonna bleed off the branch. So I'm gonna add darker brown right now. So this is my darker brown. I'm going to add darker brown. And I'm, I'm not doing the coloring, all of them. So some spot is darker brown, some spot is lighter brown. So it looks like a branch. See how I'm doing it? Oh yeah, we should do shadows. Hang on, the shadows on the, on the, the bottom of the bird and the lake. So leave that area untouched first. So try to do the shading on the branch first. So I'm doing some of the spot area is darker brown. So this is a little bit darker because this branch is behind the bird. So when, a, when the sunlight is coming this way from the left, this area is darker. The right area is always darker. Because that's the shadow. See how I'm doing this part here is darker. And again, try to, if you want to do the darker spot, try to cover all the white. You see that? Very nice. But make sure you cover I most. The area the lake. I, I haven't touched that yet. Hang on. Okay. I will do it. Tristan, you're not done yet. Ow. Tristan, come back. You did your bird really nice. Can you don't ruin your branch, please? Can you fit it? I didn't. So one direction. Always do one direction, Tristan. Look. It's a color. No, you, you're doing like zigzag again. I don't want to do zigzag. Do one direction. 
Why you why you always at the end you didn't finish it nicely? Okay, you see how your branches look like now. I'm gonna add my my shadows area here on the under the underneath the tummy. So the legs area, I finally cover it with the shade, light shade of the brown that I use. All right, very light shade. Because I'm gonna add the shadows later. Okay. Oh. Yes. Who is talking? Just by accident. Okay. Never mind. So those are the shadows. Same thing. Just then, put the paper on the table. You need to sharpen it's your this. pencil. You need to sharpen your pencil. Put it, put it flat down. I can't because of the carpet. This thing. What carpet? This is a carpet. This is a tablecloth. It's, it's table carpet. But it's just bumpy. Justin, come here. This make it flat is not that hard, okay? It's not rocket science. Okay, so this is the, the area that I wanted to show you how to do shadows area, okay? So I'm gonna use the darkest brown that you have. Darkest brown. What happened? Okay. This is the darker brown. This is the darker brown I have. I'm gonna use the darkest brown that I have. I'm gonna put some shadows underneath the legs area. It looks like purple. Except the darkest brown is the same color. No, no, no. As the. Look, then you use black. Okay, black. If that's the case, use black. Okay, but make sure you use black. It's a very gentle. Just then. Make sure you don't push it too hard. So I'm using black too because mine is just like what Tristan was saying. It's a similar color of the leg. So I'm, we're going to use black, okay? If you have a different color legs, see, I'm going to use different colors brown. So I'm going to use black. A little bit of black here underneath the crawl area. So the, the whole thing will pop. The lake will show more, okay? Can I see? There you go. Come here. It's just brown. Where's your brown? What's the brown that you use? This. Which one? This is the one that you use on the branch. Then you just, use, you, you just need to color like this, darker. And that's not the brown. Yeah, yeah, that is. See, see, this is the shadow area that I wanted to show you. All right, Tristan? You add mm -hmm. the shadows on the tummy area. Okay? Mm -hmm. See? So you add this area and then this area, same thing. You just need to do the same direction, okay? If you, if you color it the different direction, it looks weird. It doesn't look like a branch tube anymore. Make sure your your area here is always one direction, like this, okay? Anyone wanted to show me when it's the whole branch is done? The whole drawing is done. Let's see who finished it first. I'm, I'm done. You just have to clean up your, your branches a little bit more, okay? Mm. Excuse me, Miss Kathy. Um, yes. This picture, like uh, a theory for the shadows, like which way is the sun pointing for like the, the sun? The sun pointing this way on the left. Okay. 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 So like from the left to the right. Yes, to left to the right, exactly. So that's why your shadow is it's a little bit more on the okay. right hand side. You see, this is darker. This side is darker. And then also the, the below of the tummy is darker too. Okay. Okay. Yes, Vivian? You want to show me yours? Okay. Let's see. Wow, look at that blending. Good job, Vivian. Do you like it? 
Yeah? Good job. I love it. What a cute little birdie. Thank you. You're welcome. Kaden wanted to show me yours. Yes, Kaden. Nice. Good job, Kaden. Wow, look at the big fat one. That's really cute. <laughs> Good job, Kara. Bye. Yes, if you guys are done, you guys can lock off, okay? Make sure you take a picture bye. of it and send it to me, okay? Okay, bye. Bye. All right, good job, Aiden. Thank you. Thank You're you. Welcome. Bye. Bye. Bye, thank you. I want to see bye. everybody before you lock off, okay? Um, Avery, can you show me yours? I really want to see yours. Bye. It's okay. Good job. Doesn't matter, okay? You're going to improve every, every, every week if you join us. Bye, oh, Auntie at... Kathy. Thank you. Good job, Vivian. You're welcome. Make sure you Thank take you a picture man. of it and send it to me. Good job, Mimi and, K and Trevor. Trevor is pregnant. Chubby. Chubby Big Bird. No, pregnant. it's Chubby Boy. <laughs> okay, let's see Trevor Ida. Chubby Boy. Good job, Ida. Hey, hey, I'm still talking. You guys stop, okay? Let me finish talking first. Ida, let me see yours. Good job. Oh, is that a reason why your uh, your your branches on the uh, on the right hand side is thinner? Mm, yeah, it's like when you put the tree and then the branch goes smaller. Oh, okay. Good job. I like that. Very cool. Good job, Zoe. Your turn. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Can I see yours, Zoe? Nice. Good job. I like it. You did the, the, the shadow really well, too, and the blending. Good job, Zoe. I hope you like your first class with us. All right. You guys can lock off. Make sure you ask your parents to um, take a picture and send it to me, okay? All right. Good job. All right. I'm going to start the recording now. You can lock off now, Zoe. Bye-bye. All right.